Why the hell are we here, Professor? Please, Carl, I'm only a physics professor. I'm not qualified to answer philosophical questions. You know what he means? Why are we here on Saturday? I'd like to show you my latest invention. What is it? It's an interdimensional gateway. When I pull this lever, I'll open a portal to another dimension. What kind of a dimension? An antimatter universe. Think of all we could learn, all we could gain from it. Can I go home now? As soon as I pull the lever. You must not let him pull that lever. Say what? Yes, please. I'm speaking to you. Professor? Hey, Professor! Please, listen to my warning. You don't have much time. If he pulls that lever... Can I go home now? As soon as I pull the lever. Hey, Professor, I... Liz, you were about to say something? Never mind. What the hell was that thing? An antimatter creature. I was afraid of this. And still you activated the machine? Statistically, we had more to gain than lose. Remind me never to take you gambling. It is imperative that we either contain or destroy this creature, for obvious reasons. It's from an antimatter universe? If it comes into contact with any form of matter, it will explode. Oh. If that's the case, shouldn't it have touched something by now? Fortunately, it's still out of phase with our universe. But as soon as it acclimates, it will become a threat. And when will that be? In about ten minutes. Nine. Nine minutes. And how are we supposed to stop it? This. A vacuum cleaner? An anti-antimatter vacuum cleaner. That was my second guess. There! Any luck? It's not by the tech building. Or the girls' locker room. Professor, guys, I found it. Follow me. That's a neat kite, but where are the strings? <laughs> Ew! Gross! Right up there. I see it. Why is it all glowing? It's adapting to our universe. Good thing we found it. We don't have a minute to spare. Then will you get on with it?
Job well done. That's a cool vacuum you got there. Oh my gosh, what's on your face? Huh? It came from that weird kite thing? Professor, that antimatter thing took a dump on his face. My god, it's acclimating. The poop's antimatter too? Stop talking and suck it up. Thanks, guys. That was close. What now, Professor? After recent events, I've concluded that this device is too dangerous to use. What events? The antimatter creature. Oh yeah, that. I'm going to dismantle it and dispose of the pieces. Professor, there's something you should know. Right before you activated the machine, I heard a voice in my head warning me about what was going to happen. A voice in your head? Liz is crazy. Liz is crazy. Or perhaps your recent episode with the brain-sucking earwig is to blame. Yeah, I guess you're right. Good riddance. Ah, just what I needed. Everything is going according to plan. <laughs>